Hey everybody. So yesterday I talked about how Patrick Laine was struggling, especially at even strength. He he was basically playing like a fourth liner. He was not producing at even strength. Um, he was producing well on the power play, but that was it. He couldn't play five on five hockey. Well, last night that struggling ended. It looks like Patrick Laine may have broken out of that slump. Um, he lit it up last night, scored a hat trick against Vancouver as Winnipeg went on to win 6-3. to three. He was plus three on the night, three goals, all even strength goals, nothing on the power play. Um, Line looked like a star player again last night. So, while for most of this season has been a struggle for Line, maybe last night broke him out of it. We'll have to see how if this you know was a one-off game or if he continues to play well um, over the next you know few weeks. But last night was the kind of game that could break him out of his slump and really put him back on pace to be one of the leading goal scorers in the NHL. Um, and it could not have come at a better time right on the day that I talk about how poor he had been up to that point in the season. But that doesn't change the fact that for the first month and a half of this season, he was not very good. However, he seems to be turning a page. He was much, much better last night. Scored some really nice goals. Um, and and he's... If he can continue to play that well, he is going to get on a hot streak. He's a very streaky scorer. Line is a very streaky scorer. He will go cold for a week, two weeks, three weeks, and then he will tear it up for a couple of weeks. And that's the way he scores. And that's how a lot of big-name goal scorers around the NHL are and have been for throughout NHL history. Big-time scores tend to be streaky. There are very few guys who are consistently high-end goal scorers. It tended, tends to come in bunches. You go for a couple weeks where you maybe have 10 goals in two weeks. Then you go a couple weeks where maybe you only have one goal. Then you have another week where you have eight goals in two weeks. And through six weeks, you have 19 goals, and it looks like you're a, a massive goal scorer, but people forget that for two weeks in there, you weren't all that great. Line had a tough start to the season, but he still has 11 goals on the year. This is his second hat trick of the season. Um, he scored a hat trick in Finland against Florida earlier in the year. Most of those goals were on the power play. Um, but he last night was a huge step in the right direction. If he can continue to to gain momentum and and continue to play better five on five, the goals will will continue to come. He's not going to have a hat trick every night. Nobody is. No, I don't care if you're Wayne Gretzky. You're not going to have a hat trick every night. But Line a took a huge step in the right direction in five on five play yesterday, um, scoring that three goals, all five on five. Um, and, and now it, it remains to be seen if he can, can continue to produce or if he goes another you know month without producing five on five. I, I doubt that. Liney's too good. He's one of the best goal scorers in the league. The kid's an absolute superstar. I expect this a lot more than what I expect than what he did the first part of this season. I, I expect this to be uh, a, a much closer, description of what his production is going to be he's going to be fine he's a great player he's a superstar player um i he he just had a bad start to the year i think when it comes down to it he had a bad start to the year but now um he he's got the chance to really really break that and i think he will and i think you're going to see a very different patrick line for the rest of this season i think you're going to see the elite goal scorer patrick line for the rest of this season so with that great job to line last night really played a huge game and a game that was an important game and he needed to play well five on five and he did that so um congratulations to line you have attempted to break your slump we'll see if he can do that you know over a period of time we'll see how the next game goes and the next game goes but a uh, big big hat trick last night for Patrick Line and he looked good as Winnipeg looked really good beating Vancouver so 
With that, like, comment, share, subscribe, follow on social media, check out offthewallhockey.com. All those links are down in the description below. If you'd like to further support Off The Wall Hockey, the link to our Patreon and our merch store is also in the description. So if you're interested in helping out that way, those links are in the description as well. Keep spreading the word about this channel. Let's keep this thing growing. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll talk to you guys soon.